Welcome back to another episode. Welcome back to What's Going On Wednesday. Now, I thought I'd jump on here and do a quick follow-up video to a video that I posted last week about solar panels. And I'll drop the video in the comments. So if you haven't seen that, you can check it out. Now, last year, we uh, basically had to buy a generator because our power system wasn't performing how it should have been. And it was basically our solar panels let, our down, let us down. And our auto sparky that installed the system let us down to the point there was no backup service, nothing at all. After multiple times to get in contact with him and being ghosted, um, solar panels just underperforming. You know, for a 1200 watt system, I was maybe getting six amps. Um, the panels were had like, um, what do they call them, like crow footprints in there. They were all cracked and, and splayed across and all that kind of stuff. Just not doing the job. Now since that last video and since this video, the, I actually put up a post on some, some uh, page and the guy that actually owns ATG got in contact with me and said sorry man I knew nothing about this I would have replaced them under warranty blah 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 yeah and I said yeah now this is nothing against you it's more against my Sparky fully let me down you know when you pay this much for a system and if you've all seen my system you'll know I didn't spare a dollar all Victron you know 600 amps lithium 1200 watts of solar 3,000 whatever, you know, it was $20,000. But I got let down and to the point where it just didn't work anymore. So way earlier in the trip, we had to buy a generator and we lived, lived by a generator. We just had to, um, just wasn't doing the job. Now, now we'll get into solar and sat. We went to Rick for another truck. Rick's got a truck we wanted to have a look at. Uh, so we went there, blah, 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 blah. Rick owns solar and sap. Said, you got any problems while you're here? You know, we'll have a quick quick look and see if we can, you know, make some improvements or whatever, you know, it's performing well, blah, 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 blah. Stick the laptop on it. We found a few problems. Before we get into the problems, well, they replaced the solar panels. 100% took us in the next day, bang, new panels on, and man, what a difference like it's what generator now we've had to use the generator maybe once in four months haven't plugged into power yeah it's it's turned the system right around from day to night night to day however you want to go about it we can run the air con you know and it's only losing about 10 percent ish um a massive improvement and Rick was kind enough to, to bring us in and change them all and man we can't thank him enough words can't describe how much we can thank him and I can thank him by hopefully some of you guys go over to his page check it out because yeah it just yeah they sell pre-wide boards you name it and I've also got another video coming out soon they give us a uh, full tour through their workshop. They make their own batteries. Everything is done in-house. Man, we went through this workshop and we were just blown away by everything. The quality, the, the standards they go through, the process, the testing. Man, for a little company in Bundaberg, what, a, what, a, uh, what an eye-opener it was. So this is kind of like a two-part video where it definitely pays to do your research. And I'm doing the research for you in this one. I may just go there. When my system got installed, I was contacted by someone. You know, I got a, got a reasonable deal. I'm not gonna deny that. Still paid for it, paid cost. But, found out a few things. Wasn't an auto sparky. You don't need to be an auto sparky to install 
stuff up to I think 48 volt definitely helps if you've obviously done a trade I mean there are some really smart people out there definitely helps to really know what you're talking about and then on that they went through the SIBO uh, system and man they found out that batteries weren't even in a lithium profile char a lithium charging profile it's just like what the fuck did I pay for kind of thing it's just so disappointed in it it just you spend all that money and then bang you're kind of like left out in the dark no backup service no yeah really disappointed in in what I got bloody hell I've I've, I've talked to Rick at least once a week you know Rick's become and the, the whole team have become good friends constantly asking how's it going you know it's just the way a company should be they're just yeah they're asking us about WA because they're coming over I mean I'm rambling on a bit now but man he just that's what you get from having gone through a company that's been in business for 20 years they know how to treat their customers man it was just a complete swap around of system as soon as we put new panels on and change the charging profile and change a couple of cables that were undersized because he didn't know what he was doing and then just bang away it went we're putting in some days on a, if it's a nice cool day sun's out and stuff I've, I've seen it at 40 amps per side one day we nearly got 80 amps and I was like I messaged Rick and sent him a screenshot going solar panels are broken and he rang me instantly and he's like, what's wrong, what's wrong? And I said, we're getting 80 amps. He's like, nice. That's the kind of company you want to deal with. Just made, kind of a weight was lifted off our shoulders. We were forever worrying about power. Now we don't worry about anything. It's just uh, changed our system and changed our life, really. Um, but yeah, I'll stop rambling now and yeah, can't thank Rick enough. I'll drop the video in, and then maybe in a couple of weeks I'll put the other video out of of the um, workshop run through. I'll drop all Rick's info probably in the comments. But yeah, really can't thank Rick enough and the team. Like they just oh, reached out, did everything. Worth getting in contact for your next power system. I tell you that. But on that note, we'll leave it there. And uh, we'll see you next time.